Good morning. Welcome to WJZ.com. I'm making this presentation for you just after 10. We'll be with you hourly here for the next few hours, and meteorologist Chelsea Ingram will step in and take over the rest of the day. Fed Hill looking awful pretty on a Sunday morning. I want to show you some temperatures around because if you take the elephant out of the room, which is the snowfall, it has been another seasonally mild overnight. But right now, we're pretty much at what's going to be our daytime high as we move through the day. 31 is the official forecast high. In other words, temperatures basically remaining steady. Radar still shows snow falling uh, through the area. This isn't really going to change for many, many hours. We're part of a much bigger system affecting with some sort of weather millions of people in the eastern half of the United States. Meteorologist Jill Ingram left us her timeline for this event, and I'm going to show it to you in a second. Because I want you to note, winter storm warnings are in effect through 6 a.m. Tuesday. Where you don't see the pink, there's an advisory which could easily become a warning. Now, here's that timeline. Now, through 10 p.m. tonight, snow and maybe heavy at times. The actual forecast is snow of varying amounts. But generally speaking, through 10 o'clock, we'll be dealing with just snow. Then overnight, the winds coming off the east, coming off the ocean and the bay, are going to start warming up the mid mid-level layers of the atmosphere, and we could start seeing mixing with sleet or freezing rain, and that's going to go for 14 hours. And all we need is a little bit of ice belt like that, and life becomes problematic. Then 2 o'clock tomorrow afternoon through Tuesday morning when this thing winds itself down, a transition back to snow. Each burst of snow could be about 5 inches worth. Now, I'm going to bring in the future cast, and I want you to note first what we're going to call phase one, moving through the area, and by 11 o'clock, here comes that mixed precept starting to blend in. Remember, we're dealing with a big area of low pressure, counterclockwise rotation around it. Look at the moisture and the energy come around the top of the low, and then bang, right back in here for a second wave, totals of which will be 8 to 12, 4 to 8, 2 to 4, or trace amounts, even snow in Ocean City here. There's not going to be a snow rain line. This is indeed a pretty hefty winter weather event. I don't think we've had one like this in about three years. But it's a pretty hefty winter weather event when Ocean City sees snow. So 31, 33, snow of varying intensity. The wind does pick up overnight. 31 will be your low. Moving beyond this bump in the road, the calm and seasonally mild winter of 2021, 20, of 2020 and 2021 will continue. 43 Thursday, basically 50 degrees Friday and Saturday, albeit with some showers around. Thanks so much for stopping by WJZ.com. We'll see you next hour.